Collier. <laughs> What is your name, please? My name is Barney Hill. Incidentally, panel, the story of Betty and Barney Hill is the subject of a fascinating book by John G. Fuller called The Interrupted Journey. Let's start the questioning with Orson Bean. Orson? Thank you. Well, I, I, whoever you are, I want you to know that I read every word of, of the story that was printed in the magazine about you, and I believe it. I, it's impossible to disbelieve. What physical symptoms did you later notice? I'm referring to physical uh, things uh, that appeared on you. Uh, warts. Warts. Yes. Hmm. Kitty Carlisle. When you were examined physically, were you examined in the usual sense that we would make an examination in, uh, on Earth? Yes. You were? Yes. Uh, I'm sorry, Kitty. Tom. Thank you, bud. This is a, a great story. We could spend a lot of time, and I will. Number one, <laughs> do you actually have any memories of this? Yes. Were you alert when you were in the ship and awake? Uh, more like in a somnambulistic state. Then you... Peggy Cass. Thank you. Number one, did they stick a needle in Betty, too? Uh, yes, they stuck a needle in Betty. Hmm. Number th Were they like our needles, number one? <laughs> I didn't see the needle. Oh. Uh, number one, were they the same uh, build as us? I mean, you know, or did they like have pointy heads or something? <coughs> no, they had large cranium and uh, the uh, chin was very small. Wouldn't you know it? Ah, that's all the time we had. Wish we did have more. I voted for number one, bud. Uh, I, I couldn't tell anything from the stories that they each told, but he looked like the kind of man who would have binoculars handy in his car. <laughs> <laughs> Peggy Cat. I voted for... Uh, number one, because they had big heads and receding chins, and wouldn't you know it? Arson B. I think that there's two great liars up there, and I had no way of judging, except that the whole thing took place around New England, and when I asked number one about the warts, he said, Watts. They had watts on. <laughs> and I'm from New England, too, and I know that watts is watts is watts. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir. Glad they let you back to us safe and sound. That's important, too. Did the headaches and things go away, all of his bad... Uh... Uh, actually, there weren't headaches. Uh, there was distress. I developed an ulcer, and okay. Betty had a series of yeah. dreams that lasted for about five days. That's all gone now. Yes. Thank, Thank you. goodness. That's good. Sir.